I've led you to slaughter before, so you know, don't, <laughs> hey, don't trust me. Don't trust me. No, that was one of the first things as a professional broadcaster I learned, Dan. Not yes, to trust you. But, yes, you know. but you were you were so earnest, and I I led you to slaughter, and I I felt bad. I felt bad after the fact that I embarrassed you in front of Susie Colbert. <laughs> <laughs> we're really going there. Do you what? Should I tell the story, Dan? Now that you just walked me into it, or is that what you're saying? I mean, was it we at a party and I was talking to her? I had just arrived at ESPN. And I said to her, where are you from? And you, was it a backyard? Whose yeah. house? What, was it her house? It was her going away party? Lori, was? Lori Zalbowitz's house. <laughs> wow. Good memory. <laughs> so, I think that was the one person Kenny didn't ma- mention in his LA Times article. So, you know, we're, we're in the backyard. We're in the backyard. And um, I say to Susie Culver, hey, you know, uh, where are you from? And you're 20 yards away. And you're oh, I'm from Ohio. <laughs> and like the needle ripped off the record. <laughs> and uh, you're like, oh, uh, you weren't talking to me, huh? Oh, no, go back to what you're doing. And it was just, that was the end of the conversation. I know. I know. Um, I know. And so, yeah, we go way back, Dan. Yeah, yeah, we do. We do. Uh, so Kenny Main kind of gets this farewell show. Did you get a farewell show at the mothership? Um, in a cardboard box. With all my belongings. Oh, that's right. You they <laughs> asked, did they escort you out of the building? No, you- it was actually I got a a, a a fax three days before the end of my contract saying it was over, um, and then I showed up the next day to see what was going on, and it was like, yeah, that's that's it. No one escorted me to the door, but I did not have a farewell, um, you know, show. Yeah, Kenny but gets the- a he gets his own show. On Monday well, night, the, I think. Per- the person who was in charge at the time when I got the gate, Dan, or when we decided to part ways, um, isn't there anymore. I've got a great relationship with everybody at the Worldwide Leader, as I think, you know, you do. Um, but I-, I-, I told you this, Dan, like seeing you with KO on the set of Sports Center um, a couple years ago, was that? I yeah. think it was, a year and, and a half it, ago. you know, it was great to see the two of you because it was, you know, classic, all-time great television when the two of you did Sports Center together, and it was what made the place how the great spot that it was, and part with some other great combinations that I was fortunate enough to arrive um, in 1996 and then get hooked up with Stewart. It was really tough for me to watch, though. I had to turn it off because I'll be honest, like I, I, don't, I know I didn't I, I'm not going to get a chance to have that type of show with Stewart anymore. And it really hit me hard because I do love the times that I was there. And um, so, yeah, you know, I, it, 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 it didn't end well in, in 2003, but everything has gone on very well since then. And my relationship with, with the worldwide leader everybody there is is great 